One of the things that often happens is I get parents coming in and they're extremely frustrated. And usually the reason that they're so frustrated is because they have unrealistic expectations about what's happening in their home. And this is often common with caregivers that have raised children before and that have now um, embarked on the journey to raise a child from a hard place. And so one of the things that I always tell caregivers, it's really important to understand that if a child has experienced trauma, it's likely that emotionally they're going to be half their chronological age. And so what happens in those scenarios is somewhere along the line, the child got off the track. And it's really important in order for us to get the train back on the track to go back to where we started and pick up from there. So it's usually going to be about half their chronological chronological age is where we're going to establish an expectation. The second thing that I always like to point out to caregivers is that we cannot control another human being, even a little one. So putting expectations on a child is difficult. So in that case, what we want to do is make sure that we can put the expectations actually on ourselves because we can control ourselves. And what the child needs most in that moment and what the caregiver needs most in that moment is to have an element of control for themselves. And what they can do is say, I'm going to be calm in this moment. I'm going to teach my child in this moment, or I'm going to model the appropriate behavior in this moment. So if parents can adjust those two things, the expectation of what's really happening with that child and adjusting their own expectations, we're going to see a lot less frustration and we're going to see a child start to grow and learn.